B1 Storm Tracker Chief Meteorologist Jeff Castle with 31 Triple Doppler. The hot and humid weather we've been feeling for quite some time here, but really ramping up today. Yeah, it is starting to get hotter. The humidity will take a few more days to really start mm -hmm. to set back in, but by this time next week, oh, that's not going to feel great out there whatsoever. And, and up until today, mm -hmm. uh, oh, yeah. actually didn't feel too bad. Today, though, started to get a little toasty, and that is a sign of things to come. Let's take a look <laughs> at it here. Uh, that is our story. The high temperatures getting a little bit higher. We're talking mid-90s heading into the weekend. Feels like numbers or the heat index as we work our way on through the weekend. It really won't be all that out of control within a couple degrees of what we are going to see on the thermometers. But again, next week is going to be a different story. Case in point, this is our forecast heat index for Monday afternoon around 4 o'clock. Low 100s look to be a possibility. We head into Tuesday won't change a whole lot. So again, expected to get a lot steamier out there in the coming days, particularly by the beginning of next week. That will also coincide with the return of some rain chances around here. Uh, for now, though, there is no rain to talk about. Way 31 triple Doppler is looking. We've got three live radar scanning the skies here in North Alabama, Southern Middle Tennessee, but not picking up a drop out there and we're not expecting anything through this evening and tonight. Latest with future radar is showing mostly clear skies across the area. A little patch of clouds may come through late tonight. First thing tomorrow morning. Those are not something that will stick around through the day tomorrow. We'll be mostly sunny at the noon hour and continuing to see mostly sunny conditions heading into your Friday afternoon. Saturday won't be really any different. Maybe a couple patches of clouds early in the day Saturday, but once again, plenty of sunshine expected. Plenty of heat to go along with that heading into your Saturday afternoon. Overnight tonight into tomorrow morning, still not too bad on the temperatures. We'll fall back 60s to around 70 in most areas. The bigger metro areas, the Shoals, Decatur, Huntsville, a little bit warmer around 70. The outlying areas a little bit lower. Scottsboro, you dip to 67 and we're expecting similar readings around Fort Payne. So all in all, out the door tomorrow morning. Won't feel all that bad. Uh, maybe sit out on the patio, a cup of coffee before you get ready to start your day. And it'll feel comfortable at least early on. As we take you through the day tomorrow, though, steady warm up is expected. These are the latest numbers from the Way 31 Storm Tracker weather app. By the time we hit 9 in the morning, it's already at 82 degrees. By the time we reach the lunch hour, we're approaching at 90. And tomorrow afternoon, we will be in the 90s, mostly lower to mid 90s for those highs, not too far from our average for this time of year, but uh, perhaps a couple degrees above that number. Right around 90 in Rainsville, same for Mentone, Stevenson 93, we'll go 90 in Albertville. Across Madison County, looking at temperatures mostly lower to mid 90s. 94 in Huntsville will be one of the hotter spots. Hazel Green uh, back over towards New Market into the low 90s. And out here in the northwest corner of the state, numbers will be about the same. Moulton at 92, 93 for Russellville, 93 in Cherokee, and about 94 tomorrow afternoon in Florence. Here's your Way 31 Storm Tracker 10 day forecast. Nothing really changes through the weekend. We keep it in the mid 90s for highs. Overnight lows will continue to run primarily into the low end of the 70s. In the next week we go and uh, staying hot lower to mid 90s for the most part. More humid that will make it feel a bit more uncomfortable. And again, we will be looking at some rain chances back in here. Nothing that looks major, but we need a little bit of wet weather at mm -hmm. this point in time. 20% your chance of that on Monday, Tuesday. It goes a little bit higher Wednesday, Thursday up to around 30% before we perhaps get another break in the wet weather late next week and into the start of next weekend. No breaks in the heat though showing yeah. up anytime soon. So some fluctuations in the temperature, but for the most part from here on out, just expect it to be a yeah. little hot every single afternoon. You've been warned. We can brace for it and happy official summer to you. Yes, uh, 350 this afternoon, summer solstice yes. occurred. So officially <laughs> in summertime, although we know really that began around here a few weeks ago. Absolutely. Thanks, Jeff. Uh -huh. if you're